Hey guys, so this video is going to be all about my favorite books. Um, I've noticed that I always play with my bangs at the beginning of every video. This video is going to be about my favorite books and I'm just going to go ahead and get started to wrap it all up, make it at least like maybe six minutes. The first book is by Cassandra Clare. It's a really good series, and I hope you guys like it as much as I do, because it's a pretty good series. It is called The Mortal Instruments, and the first book is called City of Bones. Um, this is a really good series. Um, it's about a girl named Clarissa Frey, or Clary Frey. Um, and she is best friends with this guy named Simon, and... Well, I don't want to give you too much details, because if you want to read the book, it's pretty sick. I love this book. If you're not into the whole Twilight thing and sparkling vampires, like I'm not, this is a good book for you. Um, yeah. This is book one. I have up to book four. The fourth book is... City of Fallen Angels, and the one that just came out is City of Lost Souls, and I think that's the second to last one. They're making a movie, and I really dislike the person they chose to play the main character, Jace. I think Jace should be attractive, and in my opinion, you guys have different opinions than me, yes. In my opinion, I do not think that that guy is very attractive. So, and I also just heard that they they made this guy named Robert something as Simon, and he's not very cute either. I mean, if he were to cut his hair, spike it up, get rid of his little goatee, and wear glasses, maybe, but we'll have to see. Anyway, read this book. It's very good. Again, it's the Mortal Instruments. And the first book is called City of Bones by Cassandra Clare. Um, the next series is a series that I do no longer have the first book to. It is um, it's a pretty long series. It's by James Patterson. It's called Maximum Ride. This is the second book out of five. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven. I think the new book is coming out in August, August 8th, I believe. It's called Nevermore. Um, this one is called School's Out Forever. This is the second one, and again, it's by James Patterson. The first one is called The Angel Experiment, and it has a blue cover if you're looking for paperback like this one. This is a really good one. Now, the next one is the same, um, is the same series, but it's in manga form. If you don't know what manga is, it is like Japanese art Japanese anime in pictures and stuff uh, the first two sum up the first book so if you can't find the first book anywhere and all you can find are the mangas the mangas two of them cost about the same as one of the regular books and you can get you can color these <laughs> I don't know if I'm the only one I like to color mangas but these, this is a very good one. Um, yeah, I'm sad that it doesn't go from backwards, though, where it starts backwards. It actually goes the right way, like American form. And if you're a manga freak like I am, you would know that all mangas go the other way. But, yeah. So that's a good series. Um, the next one is called Fearless. It's a pretty good series. <clears throat> it actually has three in one. So, because this was an old book by uh, Francine Pascal, it was an old book, and they were very short books. They were probably, I think they were like this thick each, that thick each of a book. I'm not quite sure. Okay, that thick each, because that's where the last book is in this one. They're about that thick each of a book, and they shoved them all into one book and made it super, super thick took me a good while to read this. Um, I'm, a, I'm usually a fast reader, but when I'm not really into a book, I take a long time. Um, but yeah, so this is a good series. Um, I could pick this up at Walmart. 
along with all those other books i picked them all up at walmart um so those are really good series <coughs> i believe that's it those are my top three i guess unless you want to count the mangas that before um top three books let me start over if you're not into the whole sparkling vampire thing and but you do like the whole teen angst type thing and strong girl lead i'm going to i'm going to link to my, the novels that i write personally down below on writers cafe um they are about well the first one is called inner darkness and that's the one i'm most set on that i want to publish when it's done um the first book inner darkness is about a girl named lexi nash and she's a demon hunter when she was about seven her um her parents were killed right in front of her by demons and her family was raised up to where she uh, she was a demon hunter so her whole family it was tradition that everybody in her family was a demon hunter um but yeah and she uh, she goes to a school called Fairleaf School for Gifted Young Adults, and the and everybody in her time knew about um, stuff like that, demons and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, so I really hope you guys will read that and tell me what you guys think. Uh, the other one is called Jada Peace, and again, it's about um, a girl who is a, a demon hunter. But her parents are not dead in this one, and <laughs> her name is Jada Sky Peace, and yeah. I'm not going to say too much on that one because I don't have an actual plot for it. It's just kind of a idea type of thing. Anyway, um, so if you guys are interested, I'm going to link to that below on writerscafe.org. Um, I also have a Tumblr, I'm going to link to that below. Um, all these books, I will write them down below as well. Um, I think that's it. I believe that's it. So, yeah. Well, comment and subscribe. And I'll be looking forward to your comments. Bye, guys.